All right, so for today's review, we're going to be taking a look at the 3D to scale uh, Porta Potty. This is in 150 scale. And I believe at the time of this video, you can get it in two colors. You can get it in the blue, as you see here, or you can get it in a green as well. Um, to start off, uh, as you can see, the door does open. Uh, you got some simulated panel work uh, here in the plastic. You got a nice simulated, um, this is where your lock would be uh, to tell you if it's vacant or occupied. You got a nice simulated panel right there. And for some reason, uh, this door is like the shiniest part on the uh, whole thing. As you can see, you come to this side and it's kind of just bland uh, metal where you can see the print lines and everything. You got your venting right there. And then you do, you can see circular print lines on the top. And then you do have a hole that is all the way through or somewhat through uh, for some more ventilation. Come to the rear, it's the same. And then on this side, as you can see, you do have some more vent work right there. Uh, the door, as you saw, does open uh, real nice. You can see right there. Uh, the print quality right there. It's not the greatest. It's not the greatest on this piece, but you can't complain for the price. Um, and then as you can see in there, uh, some details. You got your seat. Um, and this is where all the um, waste product would go. And then it is open uh, as well to add some realism. So if you had, you know, like a vector truck or um, a truck that would clean out porta potties, you could, in theory, put a hose down there and suck out the stuff that's in there. Um, the door does close, which is nice. Uh, overall, uh, it's a nice little piece. A uh, nice little accessory from uh, 3D to scale. Like I said, not the best print quality, but you really can't complain. I believe it runs for um, like $6, $7, something like that. Uh, so if you're looking to add some detail to your diorama, uh, it does work fairly well. Uh, another thing is, if you do have an operator, uh, just like your diecast master swans, uh, they do kind of fit in there, um, so if you wanted to like, pose up somebody in there, you could, uh, which is nice. They sit, but overall, it's a nice little piece, nice quick review. I uh, probably uh, will be doing a few more three to scale reviews. I do have a, a few more of their pieces uh, in one to fifty scale. I'm not sure if this comes in one sixty four scale or one eighty seven scale, but I know it is one fifty scale. Uh, so that's just about it for this review. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Uh, if you'd like to see a review of anything that I have that has not been reviewed already, uh, feel free to leave a comment. And thank you for watching, and stay tuned for the next video to be uploaded.